उत्तर प्रदेश प्रयागराज नेशनल ला यूनर्सी निर्माण के राष्ट्रपति रामनाथ कोविंद सुप्रीम कोर्ट चीफ जस्टिस एन वि रमण यूपीसीएम योगी आदित्यनाथ गवर्नर आनंदीबेन पटेल शंकुस्थापन चुदा concept of the national sport development project and its implementation the national judicial infrastructure corporation shall be along the lines of the different infrastructure development statutory bodies that work towards certain national assets across the country <coughs> one of the design principles that njit will follow is socially responsible and inclusive architecture today the construction of the new multi level parking and advocate chamber complex in alabad high court is an important step in creating a barrier free citizen friendly atmosphere i have been told that advocates in alabad were in great difficulty as they still do not have proper chamber i am glad to find that the needs of women and differentially able have been consciously considered this is a welcome move for advocates and litigants i hope that the new complex will re-energize the alabad bar i do not want to point any finger or lay any blame regarding the pendency in the alabad high court relating to the criminal matter which is very very i request alabad bar and bench to work together and cooperate to resolve this issue the laying of foundation stone for the proposed national law university in alabad is a significant step as the honorable president laid the foundation stone for the national law university i was reminded of the words of mahatma gandhi i quote what is really needed to make democracy functioning is not knowledge of facts but right education unquote I hope the addition of this university will serve the nation and its people well. The growth of our legal system goes hand in hand with the growth in legal education. It is necessary for the country to have quality legal education, which produces professionals who fulfil the legal needs of the ever increasing population. Today, I have also had the honor of unveiling the portrait of one of the most celebrated lawyers of the Allahabad bar someone who is a role model to all young lawyers and law students the late anand bhushan seren who was one of the best and most respected senior advocates of malabar he was well known for his wit and intellect and for his ability to come up with the practical solutions on the spot he never lost his composure in any situation However, what his juniors and associates recollect about him was his extraordinary work ethic, his punctuality, and the amount of hard work he put into all his matters. Till his last days, he never wavered from his routine and was still working without ever making excuse of ill health. He earned him universally respect and admiration. Working closely with his son, Brother Justice Vinay Sharan, I can say that. my brother has imbibed some of his best qualities by watching his eminent father lastly i would like to take a few minutes to place on record my gratitude to for the support of the honorable president of india who always gives priority to the legal community as a former lawyer himself he understands the troubles and the difficulties faced by those in the legal community and has always taken an active role in attempting to resolve any issues faced by us it was his idea to translate the judgments of the supreme court to vernacular languages to increase access to justice which has now been implemented whenever we meet he always asks about the welfare of the legal fraternity and he is always thinking of improving the legal aid system for the underprivileged since the time today morning i met the honorable president at the airport like a family elder he has been suffering with lot of love and affection i am indebted to him sir actually i 
Honorable President of India who requested and told me that we have to come to Allahabad and Lucknow, both places, during my tenure and meet with the members of the bar and visit the bench. I am thank you very much for the Honorable President of India.